All right. Good morning. Welcome to the 12th annual State of the Map US. 12th. <laughs> I'm a wanderer, so this is, this is going to be hard for me. Uh, my name is Maggie Colley. Um, I have the honor of serving as the Executive Director for OpenStreetMap US. Uh, OpenStreetMap US is the nonprofit that is your host this weekend. Um, we've been hosting this for 12 years, and there's many of you that have been with us through that entire journey, so it's great to see a lot of new faces, but also a lot of old friends. I've got the camera ready. So this is my first question. How many people are attending this for the first time? Please put your hands up high and hold them. That's awesome. Welcome. Um, it's one of the reasons we change cities each year is to make it easier for folks to attend from the region they're in. So I'm really happy to see you all and, and welcome you to your, what is hopefully just your first of many. How about the old timers? We got to give you a shout out. How many people have been to a state of the map before? All right. I'd say it's 60-40. Old timers, we got to step up. <laughs> Um, so this is the part of the presentation where I do a lot of thank yous, so bear with me. I um, also do a lot of announcements, and then we'll get to the programming. But I have to give uh, a big thank you to, as she's walking in, uh, the door, the OSMUS team. Um, please raise your hands. We've got Nellie Blair in the back and Quincy Morgan. <laughs> Putting this conference on is a lot of work, and we definitely couldn't have done it without those two. So. Thank you very much. Um, thanks to our board. Uh, if you're in the room, please raise your hands. We have a volunteer board at OSMUS, and these folks serve out of the kindness of their hearts and interest in this project, and they are along for the ride and have helped us get to this point as well. So give them a round of applause. Each year, we also have a program committee that volunteers their time to review. This year, we had 130 talk submissions um, for the program. We managed to fit in 88, which is because I try to fit as many folks as possible on the program, which is why it's so packed. But program committee, please make yourselves known. Um, and thank you so much for all of your work over the last six months. <laughs> And then we've got volunteers, folks at the desk, thank you very much. Uh, we got a few of our volunteers throughout the, the weekend, so please raise your hands and, and give those folks a lot of fun. And then there's the sponsors. So the coffee this morning, thank you very much to those sponsors. Um, we've got some platinum sponsors. We had three this year, so special thanks to Microsoft, to Esri, and Meta. And we've got three gold to match. Uh, so thank you to All Trails, Grab Maps, and Near Map. You may have seen another banner on your way in. Um, there, there's two rooms this year. All the program is going to happen here in this building. Um, this is the main room, Douglas. And then Alpine, City Creek, and Bonneville are down the hallway um, up and to the right. Across the patio is the granite ballroom. So anything on your schedule that says granite ballroom is going to be over there. We're going to have lunch there, uh, coffee break in the afternoon, and then also all the sponsor booths are over there. So it's a great place to go and meet. There's also a lounge over there for conversations. If it wasn't 700 degrees, the patio would be a nice place to congregate. But um, if you like heat, I say don't go for it. Just remember to hydrate. <laughs> um, each year, we have uh, folks apply to be scholars for the conference. Um, this year, we actually had 15 that we tried to bring. Um, but due to visa delays and, and external costs, we, we ended up with eight wonderful scholars. So scholars, welcome. And please raise your hands. Um, and thank you for, for being here. I think our farthest traveler is from Brazil. So definitely meet her. This is my favorite part. So <laughs> we have a code of conduct. And you all signed it when you registered. Um, but if should something come up, uh, it's basically, it says, be nice or leave. Uh, but should something come up, we have a wonderful volunteer governance committee. And three of those members are here. Uh, Clifford Snow, Ian Dees, and Yunzi Lin are here. So please look for them, or look for me, or anyone from the board if, if you need help with anything, or if you have an issue. 
Thank you, a couple more thank yous. <laughs> OpenStreetMap US is a, a member-driven organization. Um, so we have individual members and organizational members that help support our mission and keep us running um, financially. We have 240 individual members. How many of you are in the room? Sweet, <laughs> welcome. We will be doing a membership drive. So if you're interested in becoming a member, it's $20 a year. We will be doing a raffle tomorrow for anyone who signs up to be a member while they're here and any of our existing members. So you'll have to go to the OSMUS table in the Granite Ballroom to get your raffle ticket um, and we've got a bunch of swag. I promise you it won't be a 45 minute raffle. We're gonna give away things quickly. <laughs> but definitely if you're interested, um, go ahead and, and see someone at the OSMUS table. This year we saw a big increase in our organizational membership as well. So many of those companies are also here and, and government agencies. So th thanks to all these, these new members. Um, this is a newer program for us and it's been, it's been really great to see the support coming in. So um, if you want your company's name on that slide next year, come see me. You may have gotten an email or two from this thing called Whova. <laughs> And if you haven't downloaded it, it's going to keep nagging you too. So <laughs> um, we have moved away from our print program this year um, for many reasons. Uh, but this is a little greener, and it allows us to change things at the last minute, because you know how that happens. Um, so if you haven't downloaded it, it's really helpful. We'll put announcements there. I realize people don't read anything, so we're going to like repeat ourselves a million times um, and, and hopefully do smaller bite-sized points of information, like, hey, it's time for lunch. Um, but if you haven't done that, the program's on there. It's gonna be the most up-to-date uh, program, but there's also program sheets outside of each room. Um, and it's a great way to connect with other attendees if you forget someone's name or wanna meet them later. Or there's a couple meetups, hack, like a hike on Sunday people are setting up, so um, let us know how it goes. This is the first time we've done an app, so. All right, we're almost there. Um, tonight's activities, uh, you might have seen the B2B is going to be in the Granite Ballroom across. Uh, it is a ticketed event. If you haven't bought a ticket but you'd like to join us, there's still a few spaces, so um, go find someone that can help you. <laughs> Maybe at the registration desk or just go online and you can get a ticket there. Um, the scavenger hunt, we did this in Richmond last year. Unfortunately, it's a little warm for this, but all of the locations, sneak preview, aren't that far away. So form a team, it's, it's a great way to meet other attendees um, and have some fun finding some interesting landmarks around the area and exploring Salt Lake City. Tomorrow night, we've rented out the Utah Museum of Fine Arts. Everyone's invited to this. You can even, uh, if you wanna add a plus one, let us know. Um, we have access to the entire beautiful museum and all of its exhibits. We'll have food and drinks, and we've hired a, a live band, um, 16 Strings, a jazz band from here in Salt Lake City to entertain us. So it should be a lovely evening, and I hope everyone's planning to attend. Oh, I just remembered something else. How many people were there last night at the uh, social? That's why we ran out of beer in 45 minutes. <laughs> We will remedy that. Thanks to everyone who came out last night, um, and thanks to the folks who ran the workshops. It was a great time. Um, hopefully set the stage for a really great conference. Um, also, one more announcement. Speakers, if you're speaking and you didn't get the 50 emails I sent you, please be in the room that you're presenting in 15 minutes before so we can get your presentations ready on the computer so we don't do the whole thing of like, oh, I can't get to my laptop. So just so you know, now you know. Have a great conference. <laughs>
Um, I love it. I just came out of my own bed this morning. <laughs> so um, I'm already excited. Um, but I want to extend a couple thank yous. Just um, first of all, for uh, OpenStreetMap US to, uh, for picking Salt Lake City. Uh, I had nothing to do with that whatsoever. <laughs> I promise you. Um, and um, for also being incredibly supportive of local communities. So we've been going on f with this community f uh, here in Salt Lake for 13, almost 13 years now. Um, and I don't think we could have done it with the support of OpenStreetMap US. They support in all kinds of ways. Um, you know, they, they help you um, with the tools that you need to, to, to create your local community. They even, um, they even fund, fund your meetup memberships, or they used to. I don't know if that's still the case. <laughs> I still keep submitting my, my invoices. Um, so uh, th th that's been great, and we've been slowly growing and seeing our community evolve. Um, there's also, uh, like we, we have uh, the scavenger hunt tonight is a product of our local community. Um, we did a great um, walking tour around Salt Lake that was organized by Troy. Troy? Yes. Um, who's also part of our local community, so that's all. We're a tight little club, and we keep welcoming new members almost every month. So that's been that's been absolutely fantastic, and it keep it is what keeps me going with OpenStreetMap, um, the the local flavor that um, I hope to add in, on this stage in this minute. Um, the final big part of the, the local community, I think, is is the um, is UGRC, the Utah Geospatial Ref, uh, Geospatial. Greg, help me out. Resource Center. Resource Center. I get it. I know it's it was renamed a few years ago. It it changed, and I'm still I'm still not used to it. Um, they are probably um, the the one of the best among all the all the 50 states and 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 a few territories uh, with publishing open data, but also um, being supportive of OpenStreetMap in that way, right? So just not just um, not just having making the open data available, which we which you do anyway, but doing a great job of, but also. Um, Kind of having this relationship with us as a local community, and we even have some we even have some um, some joint pro uh, projects that we've that we've uh, that we've run over the past few years. Um, Greg is going to talk more about that, so I'm going to yield the stage to him. Um, just another very warm warm welcome to my hometown. I hope you enjoy it very much. Um, stay hydrated, get your sunscreen on, and uh, have a great time. Thank you. Thank you.